Diddy is done. The phone calls have been released. A Sean Combs accuser can no longer remain anonymous. That's my brother right here from day one. We used to wake up and... I mean, damn, pause. The government is fighting back against allegations of leaking information. Back in the days when he was like 10 and I was a little bit older, his older brother, we used to fight over the over the Frosted Flakes, you know what I'm saying, before pause was invented. And they also say the embattled rapper doesn't have a right to know more about the case just yet. Oh, oh, shit! Oh, did the camera catch that? Uh -oh. Can nobody hold me down? Let's get straight into it. Welcome back to another episode of Rosengold.us. I'm your host, IK, and let's get into these hot topics, starting off with the main thing in the news. The main thing in our agenda, that being that Diddy's phone calls released saying that he elicited, no, solicited an inmate. Now this is alleged, but we do have the phone call footage, so we're gonna put it in right here. Diddy and his legal team actually had the nerve to visit Cardello Smith in jail. And get this, they tried to slide him a cool $2.3 million settlement. Why? Well, according to Cardello Smith, Diddy spiked his drink and graped him at one of his infamous parties back in 1997. I know, it's a lot to take in. But wait, there's more. This little prison meetup? Yeah, it was recorded, and Diddy's name is right there in the visitor sign-in logs. Talk about leaving a paper trail. Now, the attorneys who were there are saying that Diddy pretty much confessed to everything. And even though attorney-client privilege usually keeps these convos under wraps, that recording is now being used as evidence. Yikes. Because not only were they saying he's an inmate, but he's also paid someone to say I'm a hush-hush about a quote-unquote alleged molestation case from years back that Diddy's trying to keep hidden. If you don't know what's going to happen with this footage, we'll keep you posted. But other than that, stay tuned for all the latest hot topics as we've got lots more in the hot topics that you're not going to want to miss. And to our dear friends, we'd like to give them a shout-out and mention, that being Miss Pretty Moon Now, working on the comedy circuit and doing the best in comedy as always. We love you, Miss Pretty Moon Now. Mr. D.K. Begluva, a.k.a. Randy Green, and Mr. Flash, both working on brand new projects and films. We'll put their information on the pin down below. So make sure to stay tuned for all of their latest content, its latest and greatest. And we'd like to mention Me Donuts, Yank Apparel, Cat Tattoo, Anvil Tattoo. Cat Tattoo, ask for Mr. Sherry. For Anvil Tattoo, ask for Mr. Wei Long. And with that, these are all of our hot topics. But our Cheese Hot Contest winner for this week is none other than my dear friend. But we'll post the photo right in the video right here, along with in our Instagram and YouTube feeds. Make sure to like, follow, subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next episode. Kylie Jenner.